Hi, it's Jeannie. I want to show you real quick how I use the vintage truck and the summer add-on to make this cute shirt. I'm using the Bayside Surf Company at the top and I'm going to be using um, a couture ink in the color Candy Apple. I spread on the couture ink with a squeegee, smooth it over the open areas, and then remove the transfer while it's still wet. Now I move on to the truck portion and I am going to use the Couture Teal. I'm basically just using two colors on this shirt unless I, I might add a few more colors to the surfboards but it could definitely be done in all one color. It could be done in just two colors or you can go crazy and add as many colors as you want. I'm smoothing over the Couture ink over the open areas of the transfer, smoothing it out, removing the excess, and then removing the transfer and putting it in water to clean. I'm going to wait for my truck to dry before I add the surfboard, so I'll move on down to the established at the bottom of the design. I decided to change the year out to 1969 instead of 1858, and I'm going to use the same uh, red Couture ink for the established and the year, 1969. Get those done. Quickly remove them, get them off to the water. Now on to the surfboards in the bed of the truck. There's also a beach ball along with three surfboards. So I'm going to do this beach ball in the same red color. And I could also do the surfboards in that same red but I decided, uh, let's have a little bit of fun and show you what these other colors look like on a shirt. So I'm using the kiwi and the yellow. The yellow uh, chalk couture ink that I'm using is actually called Bumblebee. The red is called Candy Apple and that lime green is called Kiwi. And there it is all finished. I just have to wait for this to dry. Once the ink is dry, I can set it with a hot iron or an easy press and then it's ready to wear.